Hi, I'm Ben and I work for the Grammy Award winning JBL Professional in their application engineering team. Today we're going to talk about the IP rating of install speakers in the control contractor range. Right, let's go meet the team. An IP rating is given as two numbers. The first number shows how protected a speaker is against physical intrusion from solid objects. An IP rating of 1 prevents against objects over 55mm, like a hand. An IP rating of 2 provides protection against objects larger than 12mm, such as a finger. Seems pretty safe. An IP rating of 3 gives us additional protection against any object larger than 2.5mm, such as a screwdriver. As we move on up the scale, this Control 28, for example, has an IP rating of 44 out of the box. That means that it's got protection against any object larger than 1mm, such as uh, some wire or uh, the snail. Uh, so now we've moved outside to show how an IP rating of 5 talks about resistance against dust and sand. Ben, do you have any sand on you? It's a workday, of course I have sand on me. So yeah, the Control 88 that we have here is indeed impervious to sand, which means it's suitable for kind of beachfront bar kind of areas and um, deserts and the like. And this is because it's this IP rating 5. Given that the second number of the two is all about uh, liquid ingress, I don't suppose you happen to have brought some water to work. Well, you did bring you? some sand to work in your pocket, so I have brought a watering can. And we do like to be prepared for all eventualities. So let's talk about how IP ratings work. Okay, so at IP something 1, you're just going to get protection against splashing water directly from above, so like a light rain shower. Okay, now IP rating 2 has got an angle, and that angle is 15 degrees, which is about that. And then we get to IP something 3, that's going to be 60 degrees, which means a bit of driving rain across the front of the cabinet should be fine. And that speaker is looking pretty well protected. Yeah, nice and clean as well. Now, IP rating 4 is where things get a little bit more interesting. Um, this can now resist splashing water from all directions for a longer period of time, so you can wash it down properly with a watering can like this, or pop it in any rainy situation where you may have driving precipitation. Now, when we get to IP rating 5... Yeah, that's, that's hosable at this point, so you can get it out and give it a good clean down. No, we weren't, we weren't allowed to play with hoses, were we? No, nor, nor IP56, which was the power washer moment, which uh, you, can be, you can be irresponsible with those, but... Um, Again, we weren't allowed it. Not after last time. The speaker did survive it, though, because it is IP56. Oh. 